our fear is what's the worst thing that can happen. I suppose the worst thing that we fear is that we're going to make it worse, we're going to say the wrong thing, the person will get upset, they'll get depressed, and God forbid, they might even die. And what will we do then? If we could let go of that need to control that outcome and just decide that we want to be part of the process in whatever way that we can be that's helpful, that's what I mean by being brave. Once you let go of your need to fix and mend it, that's the start of being brave. It's scary to be in that place because you're letting go of all that you need to contain something. But it's not about containment. This is not about containment. It's not about managing. It's about allowing. And it's recognising that this person has lived their life. They know their life. They know how they're feeling. It's not up to us to tell them how they should feel. But really it is up to us to support them in however they are feeling in that moment. A lot of the time, we can't fix what's happening. We can't change the diagnosis. We can't change the fact that this person is dying or coming to the end of their lives. But we can make a choice. And the choice we make is, I can be part of this process. So maybe the best thing to be able to say to somebody then is, look, I don't know if I'm gonna be any use to you, but I'm here.